Good morning, woodchucks. Come over to check the bee hives like we always do every morning. Need the honey, flowers. It's been a day. Don't expect much from them. Just want to make sure that they're all very wet and they seem to be. Uh, nothing from the bees there. I probably should check on the greenhouse before I forget because I don't remember the last time I actually watered the plants. How we do? Oh, yeah, they need some water. They need some water. Let's go ahead and open it on in here. Spend a little bit of cash. And go ahead and water them up. Uh, the one thing I just did before I started the day is I created a backup save. As many of you should be doing, always in early access. Um, so what's going on in Lumberjack's Dynasty that we need to talk about today other than what I want to do, which is go up and take care of these planting the seedlings, but also I got to grind up some stumps. Uh, so when the update came out a couple days ago, um, I did a video on the update, and right after that I recorded uh, the previous episode that we just did as well in the same day. Uh, so I got those two done on the day of the release of the update. Since then, reading your comments and reading on Discord channels and whatnot, yeah, there is, seems to be a rather pretty big problem here with the update. So be kind of cautious. Create backup saves as uh, if you haven't run into it or you don't know what I'm talking about. Yeah, social points. Some people are getting, they go to talk to an NPC and also get a, an enormous amount of social points. Uh, someone told me they got like two 2 billion social points when talking to someone it just went up and up and then the game crashes now the game can't load or something like that uh, some people have lost all their social points so yeah there seems to be an issue with social points um, i'm going over here to talk to uncle charles and good to see you Larry. auntie grace How let's are you? see if there's any new quests i need to know about um need see if me he's to help helping you with anything something? no nothing at the moment so we helped the mayor in the previous day and uh, for us gotta go Bye. And that was through Uncle Charles. So I'm just checking with him, make sure uh, there's no new quest going Hello, on. Oh, dear. I have not, Good to see you. I have not talked to Auntie Grace at all. Need me to help you with something? No, not now. Perhaps later. You can always stop by and ask. All right, well. Gotta go. Look after yourself. Now, you notice this time when I talked to her, she didn't say that I looked hungry or anything like that, and she didn't give me any kind of food, which is fine, uh, because she hardly ever did occasionally before. So, yep, yeah, we got the Doom Buggy. There that sits. Uh, the Platform Truck. There that sits. We need the 134. We need the Stump Grinder. We need to go up and grind those stumps. So, a few things people have asked me is they can't buy the new equipment. Um, in the update video, I did show it. You need to be in Chapter 3 in order to buy the new pieces of equipment. Plus, you also need to go talk to Logan. I guess you need to be Level 3 in Lumberjack in order to remove stumps and planting trees. Somehow, I was already there. Um... I think that might have been a bug from the early stages of Lumberjack's Dynasty. Um, how are we doing here on these here? Oh, we got plenty, plenty of days to go. Where is my, where did I leave my tractor? Oh, I left my tractor down by the stump grinder. So I made a backup save and I'm going to try to do that every day uh, when I start the day. Just create a backup save just in case something goes haywire. I can always uh, have something to fall back on. Always do that with early access games. If you can have... Oh wait, I'm not playing No Man's Land. I don't need. I don't have manual attach. Uh, <laughs> well, let's hitch that up and get up there and grind up these stumps. So yeah, on early access games, I always recommend you always create a backup save when you can and do it often. I'm gonna try to do mine every day. Uh, but my task for today is uh, I want to get I want to get this quest done. I want to get these 50 seedlings planted. I think Logan gave us uh, 90 five or something like that so some people are, were saying i've seen on the discord as well that they're having a hard time getting that many trees planted on the lot so we'll see what kind of luck that we have well let's get up there uh we'll start grinding up the stumps first give us all the room that we can make sure all the limbs are gone uh, make sure i picked up all the trees if i haven't i'm going to pick up the trees and push them aside and uh yeah bring up the planter afterwards and see if we can plant the 50 trees but well, first things first Let's go up there. Let's get this stump grinded. Or stump. Uh, should be 24 stumps, actually. Well, here we are. We have made it. So, a couple of you have said you don't really need to lower the stump grinder, which I don't. You just saw it turn green there for a second. Man, it is rather, rather a pain to get this lined up right, isn't it? 
Yeah, I'm gonna hit, keep mine raised up, I think. Come on, back up just a little bit. Boy, this is finicky. I had it twice, and then I tried to stop the tractor. Little by little. <laughs> I can't go any slower than that. Where is this thing? Oh, man. How about if I lower? Does that, does that give me a bigger area? Oh, man. They need they need to make... They got to make this bigger, I think. It's going to take me forever. Oh, nope. Oh. There we go. I got to have my finger on the F button. The F button is the one that grinds the stumps. I think I just need to keep it on the F button. And when it turns green, just get it right away. This could take me all day just to grind up these 24 stumps. And I need to grind them up for sure. Because if we don't, I'm not going to be able to get all 50 trees in here. So, yeah, there were 24 trees in here. And I got to plant pretty much double that. So it should be kind of interesting. I think I'm going to leave a stump grinder up here just because if I happen to miss something. Oh, it was up. If I happen to miss a stump, I want to make sure that's still up here. Yeah, this is going to take me a while. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, not a problem. I'll get it done. Uh, so what time is it? It's Well, it's, it's not even 8 o'clock in the morning yet, which is good because I may need the entire day to do so. And it may get kind of frustrating to watch me trying to do this over and over again, trying to find the sweet spots for it. It looks like once you start the stump grinder, it's good to go. It's too bad I don't get to collect wood chips from it. That'd be kind of interesting, wouldn't it? I probably should have been counting and keeping track how many stumps I got gotten rid of so far, but um, yeah, I'm just going to sit here for a while. Around and around we go. Uh, let me bring it back when I get, I think, where I'm close. I have no idea. Like I said, I'll try to get them all done, and I think the smart thing to do is keep the stump grinder up here. Just in case when I'm planting trees, if I happen to find another stump, I can get rid of it. And that way we can get all 50 in. Um, like I did say, some people were saying they can't get all 50 trees in. And a couple people said, yeah, you can get all 50 in, but it's very tricky to do so. So, we're going to give it our best shot. Actually, if I take it out of... Yeah, I was, I was in the second gear. If I take it and put it into first gear, maybe it won't take off as much on me here. Alright, I need to focus and... Uh, take care of these stumps see how long it takes me like I said it's quarter of eight in the morning hopefully not too long well I definitely don't want to say I'm getting the hang of this at all because I haven't figured it out um, looks like some I think it all depends on the angle of the tractor if you're on higher land or lower land cons in comparison to the stump you may have to raise or lower the stump grinder itself I've also noticed that when you're grinding the stump, I was the one on one hill, I was kind of steep. I was kind of rolling downhill, grinding the stump, and the tractor started, he started rolling. And that was a long ways from the stump, but as long as you got the action started, it keeps on continuing grinding the stump. And it did take care of it completely. So that's a good thing. Um, I can see where mowing the grass could actually help you out try to find some of these stumps as well. Because some of these dead ones here... See, that time I couldn't get it to... No, I got out of the vehicle. Didn't want to do that. I'm trying to hit all the buttons quick here so I can... <laughs> no, 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 no. There, start. There we go. Yeah, it's a... Uh, it's a little finicky. I'm glad uh, it, we have all day to do this. Uh, <laughs> give us some time. I think maybe it's like anything. Once we, get, we use it more and more and get used to it, it's not too bad, but... Just trying to get it show green there for a second is always the crucial part and when the stump grinder is actually running you cannot move the tractor so um, if your tractor is rolling down a hill or something like that you can once the stump grinder is actually in the action of removing the stump uh, you can do whatever you want and it's not going to affect you know you're not going to be able to do anything with the tractor come on where's the sweet spot for this one I saw it there. There we go. 
And man, it's kind of hard. I'm, I'm using a keyboard for this. I always use keyboard for Farmer's Dynasty and Lumberjack Dynasty. And I'm just barely tapping the keys and slightly move forward and backward. And it can be real tricky to find the spots. Does it tell me... Hang on, let me get out of the tractor. I want to get the chainsaw out. I said chainsaw out. Does it tell me... No, it doesn't say how many stumps are left. So you know when they have trees in the forest, they'll say how many trees you got left and what kind. Uh, I was kind of hoping it would tell me how many stumps I had left. Unless I removed all the stumps and I don't know it. Uh, looking around for stumps. Looking around for stumps. And it seems like the harder I'm concentrating the more I think I see a stump and it's not there. So like I said, I think for the time being, I'm going to leave this stump grinder up here in case I missed one. I don't know if things like these limbs here would affect us when we plant the trees. I have no problem leaving the stump grinder up here. I can come back up, I, you know, make my trips count. I would like to, but um, to me, it's kind of crucial to think that leave it up here for today, get the quest done. I can always come back up later in the day. Uh, at night time and pick it on up because as long as we sleep like a half hour we're good to go so I'll work late if I have to not a big deal but let's go down get the planter come back up here and see if we can get 50 trees planted in that small little lot uh, like we if you remember 24 trees were, were up here and I got to plant 50 in there people said it can be done let's see how well I can do and we've made it back up to the forest. Well, there'll be a forest here in a moment. Um, yeah, so it's uh, lo only 11 o'clock in the morning, so we're doing pretty darn good. I'm just looking to see where our boundary is. Our boundary is actually cut, is wider than where we planted. So let me go ahead and try to plant on the edge if I can here. Let's go ahead and lower that. And let's go ahead and plant one right here, because we're in the boundary. 49 to go. Now that's going to leave a circle. If I hold down the engineering button, I should be able to plant one right here. There we go. All right. Getting to be a lot of circles on the ground, but uh, we'll do the best as we can to try to get it like right on the edge. The more the merrier, right? The more the merrier. Pretty easy machine to do once you hold down the engineering button. Now, if you, I'll hold down the engineering button like I have been, uh, but I'll plant here. Now, if you watch in front of the tractor, You'll see a yellow line show up. There you go, yellow line. Uh, there's a rock in my way here, but I, I can plant one here. I know I can. Did I get one in? Yes, I did. Perfect. I wonder if we have to plant them all here. That's you know, that's kind of a question, isn't it? Uh, the rocks are getting stop me from turning there. I think. Plant the pine. Forty three to go. And I'm going around the outer circle first because that seems the most logical way to do it. If I start in the middle, then I might not uh, get them evenly planted here. So, so far, it's looking okay-ish. I planted 10, and I don't think I'm, I'm halfway around the lot yet. I'm right on the edge of my property boundary too, so. Make sure you come to a complete stop with this thing or else it's not going to plant. Let me make my way all the way around and see how many I get planted. Just on the outer circle. Well, not quite all the way around, but I'm running into a situation here where I got a tree on another piece of property, but... From the last tree I planted, or sapling I planted, I got just enough space to pop one in here. I just gotta stop at the right spot. There we go. So just by doing the outer circle, and see I can plant over here, I think. I should be able to. There we go. Now having made a full circle around, and I'm already halfway to planting all 50, People said it's kind of tricky, but you can get them all in there, so we'll see what happens here. I'm not all the way around yet. 
But we're doing pretty darn good, I think. Don't push me forward while I'm planting. I don't want that to happen. Alright, so technically I've made it all the way around. And, well, 29 of them planted. Not too bad, if I do say so myself. So now is the tricky part. I gotta start finding spots on the edge of the ones I planted to get them all in. I think this is where the tricky part is going to come in, right? So what I'm going to try to do is find the, the point where the other circles meet and plant there. Hopefully this all works out well. Alright, we're, we're making progress here. Well, down to eight more to go. Uh, the one thing I'm having an issue with a little bit is the planter itself keeps digging into the ground a little bit. So as I drive like up a hill, the planter, it almost seems like you're stuck on something. The planter is actually kind of like digging in the ground. But for those who say there's a problem of planting 50 trees in this plot of land, um, use your engineering button because, well, you can see I got five more to go. And I can plant a lot more. I'm gonna I'm gonna see how many I can actually plant in this plot. That's what I'm gonna do. See the tree planter kind of stuck into the ground there. I got pl maybe people didn't realize that uh, you can plant on the edge over there a little bit. Now I'm gonna try to avoid planting in the road. But planting 50 saplings in this lot. Yeah, not a problem whatsoever. So there's my 50. I am done. So how many plant... Uh, so I got 45 more to go. I'm gonna... I know I'm here. Um, why not see how many more I can plant, right? As I'm planting these, I'm starting to come to realization I hope Logan doesn't want me to plant more because that means I'll have to go buy more seedlings somewhere. So... Um, yes, yeah, so we had 45 left after we got the quest done I'm down to 35 which means I've planted 35 sorry not 35 more 10 more there's number 11 so yeah you can definitely get 50 planted in here no problem whatsoever So now it's probably going to get a little bit more tricky to find openings in here. Because I think we're starting to pinch ourselves in a little bit. But actually there's still plenty more room here than I thought there was. They can see the circles closing in on us. It looks like I'm going to get roughly, I don't want to say 20 more in. I mean, there's 18. I think uh, 18. So I got the original 50 plus 18. So I planted 68 saplings up here. Is that right? 68? Yeah, that's right. 68. 68 saplings. And people said they're having a hard time planting 50. I guess they're not using the engineering button. Be my guess. Uh, what is that down there? Uh, okay, let's go and let me raise this up here. What am I, what am I investigating down here? Uh, yeah, I'll eat here in a second. What if I should save the game because something weird is going on here. Now, what the hell is going on here? Uh, I don't know. What the hell is going on here? Is it the dirty water? It might be dirty water. Now, I heard some people talking about this on the Discord. It said, has anyone figured out the dirty water? And uh, that's what it could be. Uh, let me just go here to tab. Uh, not tab. Sorry, Matt. Uh, dirty matters. Go talk to Logan. So, yeah, I got to plant 68 saplings on that lot. I don't want to say it was simple. Um, but now it's, I, I removed the stumps and planted them all. And it's only 1.30 in the afternoon. So, not too bad. So, I'm going to go back drop off the tree planter because I'm done with that for a while 
um, go talk to Logan and see what uh, we have to say about this dirty water. Eventually, we'll get back around to our own field. Uh, I keep saying fields. Our own lots of land. Uh, grind up some stumps and replant some trees. I am going to take some uh, lots and like plant all one kind of saplings on it. So these are spruce. No, these are pine. So I got a whole bunch of pine. The reason why I'm kind of doing this when we a lot of people are trying to figure this out. When it comes time to make furniture, um, is it going to be different kind of types of wood for the different types of furniture or what have you? So I want to make sure I'm going to have like a whole bunch of different kind of trees on our lots. So that way when it comes time, if I need certain trees, we'll have them. But anyways, let's go down, drop this off. Uh, we'll head over, talk to Logan to find out uh, what the deal is. Well, with the trailer dropped off, I figure I'd come over here to our little lovely garage. I'm going to refuel the 134, and yes, I'm going to wash it. Just to prove I do things like that. Because <laughs> some people said, dude, wash your vehicle. Yes, we wash it. Uh, but the reason why I'm coming over here is, you know, we got the dune buggy. Yeah, we might as well use it. Kind of our form of transportation around here. Let's go find Logan see what's up. Boy, this thing gets up to speed quick. Look how fast I'm closing in on the dude. I can even take it off-road without maybe the worry about getting stuck. I don't know. Hey, Logan, you're hiding in the bushes. Scares me a little bit. Logan, we need to talk. I guess that's me telling him. Uh, what's bothering me? I've seen the water by the forest you had me work in. I mean, what the hell? Have you seen it? It's completely polluted. It's been like that for a year or so and getting worse. That's why I, I sent you. That's why you sent me there? I may need some help to investigate this. <laughs> you? Aren't you the forest guard yourself? Can't you track who's behind this? I tried many times. Somebody's up in some trash there regularly, but never when I'm around and I'm, if he knew my patrolling schedule as if he knew my oh yeah <laughs> I'll be obligated to report my playing patrols to the office if they have access to these they will always be warned alright this may be Ryan uh whatever uh okay uh you know he is the deputy mayor or someone close to mayor himself oh I, I, okay I can't read that fast anyway I'm not sure he'll be able to find out who's behind this myself I will help you, Logan. We need to find out what's, uh, who's doing this one and stop him polluting such... Yeah, okay. Uh, we can count on me. Good luck. Then come back here in time. We need my help. All right. Um, so, do I get the 5,000 social points for cleaning up the forest? Or am I still... Is this quest updated? Dirty matters. All right. So, the thing is... Uh, Try to talk to people, see if they know anything about the polluted lake. Well, he mentioned the deputy mayor and the mayor. Well, the deputy mayor... Uh, where am I? I'm, I? I'm here. So, the deputy mayor is the guy that taught us to fish right across uh, from here. So, let me zip on down. Go slow when I go across the river. I don't need to be going in the deep ends and then uh, have to pay $200 to get out. Man, this thing gets around, doesn't it? I'll park up here at the store. We'll see if he's down there. I'm trying to remember exactly where the deputy mayor lived. Let's see if he's down here fishing, first of all. Uh, the other name that he mentioned, I I don't know if that was a name or a word. I'm not understanding. Uh, I don't know if it's a translation thing, but... Uh, oh, yeah, I need to eat. Um, yeah, I don't recognize that at all. There we go. Now we're, now we're full. Uh, no, the deputy mayor is here. I can't see the deputy mayor wanting to do it because he likes the fish, so why would he pollute water, right? Hi, Ryan. Uh, would you know anything about the Pluto Lake up north? Let's, let's get right to it. Hopefully someday we'll have to actually dialogue to go along with this. Not really. Pluto Lake? Where? Um, okay. By the Dead Forest. Haven't you heard of it? Someone even suggests you might be involved. Man, now this is just a straight lie. I mean, look at me. I love fishing. I love clean air. Water. Yeah, yeah. Do I look like... See, that's why I thought when I was coming here to talk to him, like, he likes fishing, so why would he do it? All right, all right. Sorry, I didn't... Okay, no offense, man. I believe you. Okay, but this sounds serious. Talk to Matthew 
if you have a chance, the mayor, I mean, you might know something, and Lily, she may know something too. He'll start his investigation once he's back at the office. All right. Uh, I'm not going to ask him how the fishing is. So I know who Lily is. I know where the mayor is. That's not a problem. And hush, don't scare the fish. Uh, yeah. Whatever you say, dude. All right, so let's hurry up. Uh, see what we can do here. Uh, Lily. Let's go visit Lily and see what she has to say. Uh, the good news is we got our little dune buggy here, so... Let's go up and talk to Lily, then I'll make my way around to the mayor. Uh, I'm not quite sure why Lily would really know about things, but uh, she's one with nature in a way. This thing does get around. Just gotta be careful on the corners. Uh, don't be taking the corners too fast and you should be okay. Kind of checking for herbs on the way through. Let's see what Lily has to say. If she's here. I mean, I don't know where else she would be. Uh, you got any herbs down here? Hey, Herbie. Nope. Nothing there. Alright, let's see what Lily knows. Hi, Lily. How are you? Nice to see you. Anything I can do for you? Alright, um... Yeah, could you help me? One of the lakes northeast got polluted and... I am... Investigating. Okay, it says arrest there. So I heard this is really terrible, but I don't know who might have done it. Do you think James might be behind this? I heard suggesting he might be dumb. Oh, James, our quote unquote business partner. Yeah, yeah. Just think he's in this camping business and no tourists come to the polluted area. Do they? No, no. Besides, he may issues. He may be. Jeez, I can't read. Besides, he may, he may have issues, but he is dead honest. I kind of respect him for it. Right, thanks. Any other ideas? Not sure. Perhaps if you talk to someone from the office, Ryan, perhaps. Oh, here we go. Will do. Thank you, Lily. Um, Gotta go. Bye. Well, the mayor doesn't like James, uh, but Lily seems to trust James. Uh, I know where James was. He was at the last job, but. What time is it? Oh, we're, we're flying around here. Uh, let's go talk to the mayor himself, who we just met a little while ago, and see what he has for us for information. Well, the mayor is still here. He looks trustworthy. Uh, do you know about the Pluto Lake, dude? I heard some rumors about it. What if it is? There are many lakes around. I say never mind. Or are you asking for trouble, my friend? Well, that, that seems, um... I mean... <laughs> so that's it? I don't get to say... You own this hotel? I own many things around here. Many things. As the old saying goes, you need money to make more money. Let's see if he needs help with anything. Not at the moment. All right. Let me just ask him again about the lakes here. I heard some rumors about it. So, what if it is? There's many lakes around. Uh, am I looking for trouble? All right, so it seems like uh, he kind of knows something about it. Interesting. Um, I don't know who you are because you weren't here before. Wait, did I just get... Uh, nice to talk to someone for a change? Um... Let's see if they knew anything about the Pluto Lake. Uh, sorry, but no. Perhaps uh, talked. Yeah, we, we just talked to him. All right. I think I just got a prompt about um, the Pluto Lake. What did it say? I think I need to go back to talk to Logan. So, all right. So we talked to the mayor. All right. Let's go back and talk to. Yeah. I'm glad I got the buggy now because uh, I kind of need this. But it's not going to take me too long to get back to Logan to find out. Oh, I sorry, I left my scaffolding here. Can I can I put that in my back pocket and um, I'll take it with me in the buggy. There we go. Wouldn't drive like this with the platform truck, but now would I? Hey Logan, guess what I found out? So did you find out anything? Uh, not really, but I talked to people. I believe Ryan is out of the question. He loves the mountains and he seems shocked. 
Yes, you are right. Perhaps I was too quick to judge him. James seems innocent too. I mean, this would totally ruin his business, right? Keeping lakes clean seems to be in his best interest. That's right. But I talked to the mayor and... Well, he seemed nice and friendly at first. You know him well, right? But I asked him about the lake and he hushed me harshly. He said it's nothing and told me to stay out of trouble. He did? Didn't he now? Well, so it looks like he might be the one, but, but we must stop it no matter what. Alright, so how do we do this? Mayor is rich and powerful. He owns a lot of this land. We'll have to catch him and go public. We need to wait for an opportunity for now. Come back to me as soon as you see one and we will think of a plan. Um, Alright, so there's my 5,000 social points. So at some point, I guess I got to catch the mayor in an opportunity to, I mean, how am I going to catch him doing trash, right? Uh, well, I guess that's all the quests that we have for the quest line, which is fine. I got my stump grinder still up there. Uh, transportation, transportation, find the missing sheep. Uh, transportation. A lot of transportation jobs for today. But I think what I want to do is, first of all, get my dune buggy back. Uh, where am I exactly? Oh, I'm over here. Okay, now I know where I am. That's what you get for just driving through a forest. And the doom buggy is uh, kind of, I mean, you get around yeah, a lot faster. A lot faster than I thought I would originally uh, compared to the platform truck. So, dirty matters. Looks like you need to talk to all three people, I would think. So, talk to uh, the deputy mayor. Go talk to Lily, then the mayor. I mean, maybe you can just talk this to the mayor. And that might work. I'm not quite sure. But, uh... Yeah, okay, you're still doing that. There we go. Get on out. Are we all set? We're good to go? There we go. Alright, so I'm going to hop back into my 134. I need to go up and get my stump grinder because I have nothing else uh, up there to do for darn sure. Uh, get that back here because at some point, um... Yeah, I think I may have to go around, like, the lots and clear out all the bushes that we don't need. And then I can get the stumps uh, taken care of slowly but surely. Oh, yeah, we got plenty of work to do now, don't we? Uh, let me go up and grab the stump grinder and probably get close to wrapping up the episode, I would think. Because what time is it? Yeah, it's almost 5 o'clock. I mean, yeah. It's been, it's been a pretty good, pretty good progressive day, I think. Well, it does take a little time to go halfway across the map and get your equipment, so... Yeah, but since we're on the way back, let's go ahead and... Uh, we'll start grinding some stumps on our own... Well, that was our property up there. Is that our property? I, I kind of forgot. Hang on a second. I gotta check the map again. That is ours now, right? Our that property way up there. Uh, no, it is not. Okay, I thought that property was given to us. Maybe it was this green because we got to do it. So I planted more trees than I had to. So don't plant. <laughs> oh well, I still got I still got extra trees over left over from that quest, anyways. Not a big deal. So they'll get they'll get a lot of trees. I can go up there and buy it from later on with all the trees on it. If I can uh, get these kind of cut, that'd be pretty good. I mean, I'm right over the center of the darn thing. There we go. Kind of finicky these stumps, aren't they? No, I won't leave the stump grinder up. Yeah, so it's already past 6 o'clock. So even though I went up there, it was before 4 or 5. It took a while for me to get up there and get all the way back here. Man, getting these uh, taken care of. Where was the sweet spot for that? Oh, I can see I'm going to have some work. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Oh, come on. Where were you? Nope, stop it. Where? Nope, nope. Man. This is so tedious. It may take me a whole day just to do a whole, whole lot. 
So the one thing I'm kind of curious about is that tree that keeps regrowing on us. I wonder if I cut that stump out of there if that would stop doing that. But I did, we're just getting a little head start in this property over here. I think for this one here, because we planted pine up there. Uh, now that I know I don't get to keep that land, um, I may go ahead and plant the rest of the pine down here. But, I mean, if I can plant almost 68 pine on that property, I can imagine how many I can plant here. See, sometimes with the stumps, you line right up with it no problem and you're good to go. Yeah, before I go ahead and replant in here, definitely going to go ahead and take care of these bushes. Where is that sweet spot for this one? Nope, saw it. It's funny how it flickers green and all I do is just back up a little bit to where it was and then I can't get it to flicker green anymore. Nope, nope, oh, I, I, I'm hitting the button, come on. You know, in Farmer's Dynasty, I have non-alcoholic beer. They may have to bring the rear st real stuff to this one if I got, <laughs> if it's going to be this tedious to get these stumps taken care of. One more. Oh. One more for the road. Oh, I mean the road, I mean across the street. That's good enough for me today, anyways. So, yeah, I thought that property was kind of given to us, but I think they just turned it green so we could uh, work in the field. Which makes sense, I kind of get it, but man, I was planting all those down, look at what's the difference, I get all of them. I may have to go out and buy that property just because. Uh, it's not like no one else is going to cut the trees, so I'm not going to be too concerned about getting right up there and taking care of them right away. So it looks like we got the main quest line done, although sometimes you have to wait another day before another one pops up, so I may not know until tomorrow. But we got the quest lines done that we have already. Uh, so the logs we brought down. So we got 13 chipboards to bring down to the mill. Uh, all those were made from the logs that we cut down from that lot up there before. Um, we got 122, 23, and 24. 124 wet plank crates ready to go. And... 3,500 bark and how much is in here it doesn't say I forgot how much we we had in here there is bark in that trailer though I think we almost have a full trailer's worth of bark to go plus we got all these planks uh dry planks ready to go so yeah next episode wake up in the morning if we don't have any other quest I may be selling those dry uh planks because well I won't have nothing else to use them on just yet but we'll make sure for a day or two that we don't have any any more quests to do. So it seems like the mayor may be kind of questionable. I should probably try to go talk to James at some point. Um, we left James. Uh, last I knew, he was down here-ish. Somewhere down here. I think that's where we last saw him. Um, that was the last place we had to do the quest for him. Uh, but everything else is uh, looking pretty good. I mean, we're getting along with everyone except for the mayor, it seems like. The mayor seems to be an issue, I think. But, uh, yeah, we're doing pretty good. Uh, sit around right around 17 grand. <gasps> I didn't go talk to Natalie today. I need I need my milk and eggs from her. Hello. Can I help you? Yeah, sorry, Natalie. I was really late. You don't know anything about the polluted lake, lake do you? Care to trade? All right. Uh, no, we need the food. Hey, give me the eggs. And your milk. Thank you, Natalie. I'm going to disappear on you now. There we go. We're all set. All set. 7 o'clock in the evening. Yeah. Now it's late, isn't it? Well, it's not late, late. But it's late enough. Uh, we got our work done for today. And that's where we're going to call it quits. But that is going to do it for today, guys. Actually, you know what? Before we do, I should be coming down to the fire. That's what I should be doing, right? Let's light the fire so uh, the Deputy Mayor Ryan can see the fire from over the hill. That's where he is. But that's going to do it for today, guys. Hope you guys did enjoy the episode. 
I do appreciate you watching as always. I'll catch you next time right here on Lumberjacks Dynasty. But until then, have a good one.